It was recently revealed that there are close to 2,500 fossil fuel lobbyists at COP28. Pacifica TV spoke to Joseph Sikulu, the Pacific Regional Managing Director of 350.org, to find out why these numbers are so concerning. This is the largest number, actually. It's the largest delegation at COP outside of the UAE and outside of Brazil who are both the current and future presidencies. And if we think about the number 2,456, that's more than the entire population of Tokelau. That's more than the entire population of Niue. And these are people who have come here not with our futures in mind, but with the want to try and increase the profit of the fossil fuel industry. Drew Salatalilindamu highlighted the stark contrast between the overwhelming presence of fossil fuel lobbyists and the collective efforts of Pacific Island negotiators striving for climate achievements and fairness at COP. Due to the sweat and tears of Pacific Island negotiators, the achievements, uh, the Paris Agreement, the Loss and Damage Fund, and the continued fight to phase out all fossil fuels and stay below 1.5 degrees of heating, many of that is thanks to the long nights of Pacific negotiators. So why in this arena where we actually have the opportunity to fight for our survival? Do we have to settle for a process that could be rigged against us? Where the perpetrators of the climate crisis are allowed to help write the rules. This is also highlighted by youth climate champions during a panel discussion on climate leadership we need, climate leadership we want. And we can't let our leaders keep making decisions that don't align with what our communities need, what our communities want, because our communities are calling for a stop to fossil fuels extraction. You should be listening to those people who really care about our future, who care about our world, not those who want to make a profit off it. With less than a week to go for COP28, there's a strong call for leaders to align their decisions with the needs and wants of their communities. For Pacifica TV at COP28 in Dubai, I'm Amalia Rigsby.